Hey everybody, the Bond is back. Welcome to part 9 of Let's Play. I am Setsuna. Alright, looks like we do need to go this way if you want to get optional treasure. Instead of going north, which I believe leads to where we gotta go. Alright, blood pack. What does that do? Momentum effect and support bonus. Doesn't have anything else. I guess that's what we'll, uh... Go with what we have for now. See ya! Okay, first thing I want to do... I want to switch out Julianne for Nadir. Because it looks like we got a boss coming? That is why I checked that before recording. And if it is a boss, you just reload the save file. Okay. Is there any food I want to eat? Uh, let's just sort it all the way like this. Hell bean stew might be good. Try to take them out faster. Uh, they're staring right at us. Alright, good dodge. You don't have anything to help us right away, do you? No, you don't. Uh oh. Oh, you're gonna need to heal immediately. I say one blow beat should be able to do a nice lot. Oh, press the wrong button, or I pressed it too early. Uh, let's try cleave. Uh, let's try prayer next. Uh, wind slash? That helped a little. Let's try Majin. But I want to buff it. Does special damage? What's the good of that? Doesn't seem to shake off the paralysis right away. So it looks like we'll be all right for now. Until it expires. Oh, looks like it did. Ascendant shift. Yeah, now I'm talking. I think we should be able to win this real soon. Oh, the paralysis is gone already? Oh, that's an instant kill! That's hella rude. You can just do an instant kill move. That hardly seems fair. Okay, we're gonna have to do this, aren't we? Low beat again. 
Uh, stun's nullified, though. So this is still not ideal. At least a few more hits, it's out. Beat again? Sure. It does a lot of damage. Seeker of Truth? Bye. That was a nuisance. Kira's momentary defense. Leave that off. Majin gets more attack power. I mean, what's it really for? Let's just take that. Provoke with combo power. Probably use that for a combo. A uh, shock for attack power. Okay, we'll leave that on. Now we gotta use a tent again, and then we'll save. Well, we had to use one revive, but at least we won the battle. So what else is around here? Before we get to the other side. Another Eternity Lab error. Cracked Bronze Mirror. Hey, we got a thousand experience too. Winding Snow Prairie. Hello! I see you're wandering around. On a jury journey, are ya? <laughs> Take my advice. And don't get yourself involved with the Magic Consortium. They know everything. Because they've done everything. I'm sure they're still up to no good even now. <laughs> oh, and don't tell anyone you saw me here. Seems like a friendly guy. Willing to be honest with me right from the start. To a degree. Is that another cave? The Sunset Citron again. Archimel Ruins. Oh, I've seen these ruins before. Rooms like these before. Oh, but these are open. Hmm? Listen. Did you just hear a voice? What? Nothing. I must have imagined it. Be on your guard! These ruins are not to be taken lightly. The power of the Sprint Knight here is so strong that it can play tricks on one's mind. You must not allow the ruins to consume you. Okay. Ah, oh, snake fiend. Oh, I've seen Snectors before. They're nothing new. Alright, you did good. We can put Julianne back in for now. Ah, we made a bridge. One of those ruins actually has some connection to the other ruins we saw. That was an actual tower. Yeah, that did enough. As far as we didn't get a sneak attack. Oh, burning bite.
Oh, you don't have anything that gets rid of status ailments right away, do you? Sucks. Process probably sticks with me. It does! So I have to use an item right now. Well, good thing I got the crescent grass. Broken indigo necklace. Oh! Hey, yeah, they both saw me. But they can't do squat. Only allowed to move so far. I think that one saw me. Damn it, it did see me! So guess what? I can't do a freaking paralysis! Two of us paralyzed! And we can't use heal, which would have fixed the status ailment, too. So Setsuna's gotta do it all. Almost. Do I have any, like, Sprint Knight that recovers status ailments? So I would gladly use that. So we don't run out of Crescent Grass. If anyone would have it, it'd probably be you. Nope, you, you don't have it. Well, we do have an extra slot, so sanctity it is. And I guess you can take Stone Slash. No, I don't think we have anything for that. Not a single thing, so guess what? Now I gotta use this again, too! That's gonna get obnoxious real quick. If we're gonna get paralyzed nearly every single fight with these damn snakes. How do I not have a spell that just removes status ailments? Or I do have it, and it's always the one that could possibly do it that gets paralyzed, so it's pointless! I have one of it. And I pressed the button at the wrong time again. You better not paralyze her. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Well, get rid of that. If I press this, that'll reveal the way here. What else is over there? More enemies. Ah! Okay, you can't just reactivate or deactivate it. Blue Frost? Okay, adds water elemental damage to all attacks. So we gotta hope that they're not strong against water, whatever we run against. the one that can get rid of paralysis now. This is starting to piss me off now. 
If I known this would have happened, I would have bought way more crescent grasses than this. Okay, now there's nothing else here. I bet there's a bridge on the other side we could make. That means we have to go here first. Fine, just ignore them for now. Counter-Strike? Dying power and support bonus. That means that move is gonna get really strong when I'm on really low HP, but why would I want to be on that? How does that not count as like a preemptive strike? Okay, the new weapon allows me to just obliterate them like that. So yeah, you're gonna get paralyzed maybe every single fight against those damn snakes. Every single one. Unless you can one-shot them. They're everywhere! They're the only enemy in this place so far! Yeah, if you get the sneak attack, they're done! If you get it. I would like to run into something new. So in other words, they're not going to do it. I hit it too early! That means they all live. Okay, at least they both used the breath. That's a little bit better. See ya. Ah, we had to go here first. So, left is where we need to go. What's over the other way? Treasure chest? Look at that! I saw him! Just block his way! Red rock salt? Wait. I don't think I ever picked that up. Oh, this is considered a new area now. The Fridging Mountain Range is considered a new spot. I see. Alright, that way is pointless. Listen to... Listen to me, Nadir. What? Nadir! And dear! No, they kicked us out of the tower. Where are the ruins? What the hell? Where are we? 
We were all inside the ruins, right? Where have the others gone? What the? What the hell is that thing? It's Unidir. Come on, give a guy a break. I ain't that ugly looking. It's hard to bring myself to do this. This thing definitely seems to be a monster. So I ain't gonna be pulling no punches. Come on, let's go. What am I going to do? Hey, what? It disappeared. What was that? Thing. Anyway, standing around here ain't gonna do us no good. Let's head on. This is... Please look after my sister, Nadir. This pilgrimage is being joined by the strongest guard possible. I'm on the team after all. We'll be in the last lands in no time at all. He's right. There's no need to worry. I know Nadir will protect me. Nadir, when you get back, I have something important to talk to you about. Something important? If it's about our win, I already asked the chief. No, it's not that. I think you'll probably be quite surprised. Well, that's something to look forward to. Alright, see you when I get back. What is this? Looks like flashbacks of your past. Not again! Damn it! They're burning up! This definitely ain't no case of the flu. I'm sorry. I'm sorry to do this in the middle of our journey. At this rate, you might not even make it to the Last Lands. Let's turn back for now. No! We cannot! I want to fulfill my duty. As sacrifice. I'll be fine soon. Don't worry. Please. Just wait. A little longer. Nanase. This... This is my... What the hell is going on? Nanase, hang in there. I'm sorry. I think this is the end for me. No, you can't give up. I promise to get you to the last lands, no matter what. I know my own body better than anyone. So you knew your illness was this bad? Why didn't you say something? No, in truth, it is not my illness that ails me. It is my love for you. What? But in your heart, there is only room for my sister, Mana. Knowing that has been so hard for me, so painful. If my love is to be unrequited, then at least as sacrifice, I wanted to be able to watch over this world. I wanted to protect it. I wanted to protect you. Hey, stop it! Nanase! Open your eyes! Nanase! That just adds a lot of layers to your past, man. Is that it? Is that all you've got? This guilt. This pain. It won't go away. 
Come on. Let's go, damn it. I ain't gonna be pulling no punches. Stop it. Please, stop. You know it yourself, don't ya? No matter how many monsters you kill, that guilt ain't never going away. Be strong. It's no use. No matter how much I regret it, I can never change the past. What I did can never be undone. How pathetic. Miserable swordsman with nothing left to live for except his own guilt. You bring unhappiness to everyone around you. Why don't you just die? Look, don't lose sight of yourself. I will protect a sacrifice. Nothing else. That's all I have now. I ain't got nothing else left. In the end, you couldn't make either girl happy. I... But I... I know you've blindly agreed to serve as guard once more. You plan on letting another sacrifice die, do ya? Keep fighting! Don't give up! Yeah, I know. Fighting is all I'm good for now. The only way I'll ever make up for the past is through battle. All I can do is fight. But... What am I fighting against now? Who am I fighting against? You failed to guard the sacrifice. You brought sorrow to the world. In the end, you couldn't even protect the people you love. Your life is worthless. You don't deserve to live. You. Are you... Finally figured it out, eh? That's right. I'm you. I'm here to punish you for the mistakes in your past. What? What should I do? Forgive yourself. Forgive myself. All this time, I've been blaming myself. Everything I've been doing. Was it all just to satisfy my own ego? So all this time, I've been fighting against... Finally. I understand now. It ain't the past having its revenge against me. It's just me who is clinging on to it. And hurting myself by doing so. It was my own self-pity making me cling to the past. I need to... Forgive myself. Sorry. I think it's time to let you go. To let the past go. Thanks. Thanks for being with me all this time. Alright, fine. Finally. Finally, you listened to me, Nadir. Mana? Is that you, Mana? Who's that little girl? It's strange. It's like... I've met her somewhere before. She's your daughter! My daughter? Her name is Setsuna! Yes. I know. When you set off on your journey, I said I had something to talk about, didn't I? I had a new life inside me. A life created by the two of us. Thank you, Mana. Thank you, Setsuna. Okay, I was not expecting that at all. Please look down for our daughter. Please protect our father. She is this world's last hope. Finally! They opened their eyes! Thank goodness! You're both alright! 
You both passed out all of a sudden. Don't you remember anything? Said Suna. What's wrong? Oh, I, uh... No, I don't remember anything. Sorry for worrying all of you. Forget it! You think that was some sort of enemy attack? Why would it only affect Andir and Nadir, though? No. That was no enemy. I was just too damn thick-headed. And I had some people really worried. What's that supposed to mean? Did you knock your head, old man? Here is such a punk. But that's why I like him. Can I talk to you for a minute, Undyr? I saw a strange dream. That was no dream. I see. So you know everything. Setsuna is... Setsuna is my daughter. But for now... I want to keep this between us. Why would you do that? I know what you must be thinking. But it's for the sake of this journey. Setsuna is better off not knowing about me. If she found out, she'd be real shook up. And that'd affect our journey. Anyway, I want to protect her not as her father, but as a swordsman, as her guard. I hope you can understand. Now that I think about it, I haven't thanked you yet, have I? Thanks for saving me, Andir. No, I don't think none, but we're just bros. It's just a bro thing to do. Okay, I guess this takes us back down. No, it, it's just right here. Ah, oh, some things never change, do they? Thought we were done with snakes. Oh, now we got crows. Well, I got an elixir for that. Yeah, there wasn't an item down there, was there? No. Well, I guess I should fight the bird if I can. Black Flapper! What a great name. It's, like a, it's a crow, right? Crows? I should call them Black Flappers! Oh, they got a paralyzing gaze. They can just do that from anywhere. Ah, oh, shit. So, Burning Bite has a 100% chance of paralysis, it looks like. Oh, these guys suck. Well, rather they fight, but they also suck. Okay, for some reason that's red. I'm guessing this doesn't work? It's offline. Oh, come on. 
It would be nice to not deal with snakes every 30 seconds. And now we gotta have this fight. And we just didn't get paralyzed this time. What a relief. Magic seal? Okay, gives you extra defense power. And allows you to see HP, but we can already do that now. Oh, new enemy? And it runs up immediately! You coward. Alright, where are we going? Okay, there's a save point there. That can only mean one thing. Boss battle coming up real soon. Let's go everywhere else first. Oh, hold on. Cracked golden mirror. Oh, I might have to go back to the save point because it looks like this is a much bigger floor than I thought. Four high potions. Can't be disappointed in that. Oh, I think that bird saw me. Oh, but somehow we still got the sneak attack. I thought we got caught. That's not even all the bridge. Okay, that just leads back here. I think the problem was I kept touching those snakes on the side. And that doesn't count as a back attack. I was thinking, oh, as long as it's not the front, it's fine. No, that's not how it works. I mean, that's something I should understand long ago, but still. Ribbon Chakram. Oh, that bird's coming. Ooh. Grants powerful protection against ill fortune and nullifies all status ailments. Where have you been minutes ago? I needed that ages ago. Of course, it's always fucking Andir that gets it. The one that has the best chance to get rid of it with a spell. Well, I'm not using a crescent grass again, I'll just use a tent. Oh wait, tents don't get rid of our ailments. Cabins do that. I don't want to use my one cabin on that. Like, are you smelling salts? I mean... Wait, why does it let you use the stat healing item if it... It's, there's no ailment there. It actually uses it. Hmm. 
what an incompetent thing to put in your game. Just like... Do you have, like, poison? No, alright, you used it anyway. Get bent. I don't think that was thought through in the slightest. If I could be honest. I mean, at this rate, Setsuna's probably gonna level up again. Uh, I guess we'll use the tent now. So it looks like we got a boss coming. Should I use another food item? Maybe evasion rate might be good. Oh, you again. Looks like this time it ain't no illusion. So you are here. I am surprised. However, this time you will meet your debts. This ain't good. His magical energy has increased tenfold since last time. I have finally grown accustomed to this body. I can release my true power. Uh-oh! If we get hit with that magic, then... Why? Why do you not run? You have no hope. Of victory? Do you not value your lives? You are humans, after all. Well... Maybe we're a little different from the other humans you've met. This journey is our last hope. It won't let you get in our way! You go, girl. Now! Okay, let's get, like, a max power on blow beat. If we can. Wait, how much HP does he have? Okay, not that much. I thought he would have way more. Wait, can we use heal now? We can. Alright, what can you do? Can also inflict paralysis. Okay, he's confusion, but stun is nullified. He can still be paralyzed. Hope. What do we have? Power momentum mode effects is also increased. But not for that many seconds. Let's see how you like this. Light resistance down. That's how it's done.
Wait, what does that do? Absorb HP, absorb MP. Can I not get hit? Use it. What happens if I hit him? Okay, he still gets hurt. Oh, but he gets stuff back. Oh yeah, I should be using Blunt Blow more. Since it gives instant healing. Yeah, yeah. Alright, he's almost defeated. Got him. Ooh, lightning gives momentary defense. I don't want it twice. I'm gonna take a look at Setsuna's talisman. We did it! Eterna! Hang in there! Who on earth is this girl? How was she able to demonstrate magical energy on par with his? Eterna, thank goodness. Don't be so dramatic. I'm fine. Come on. Let's hurry up and get out of here. Yeah. I don't want to hang around here any longer than I gotta. Alright, first off, before I forget... We can see HP... Oh, you only get defense! Oh, wait, no, no, that's the other one. Oh yeah, this does only give momentary defense. Oh, freak that. Uh, what's a better one? Support bonus and momentum effect, maybe? ATP bonus and support bonus is also good. As this MP consumed... Allows her to use less, well, for that specific move. Probably tech power, ATB bonus and support bonus would be good. Let's go with tech power. Commanding wave is good because it lets her get turns faster. Maybe Life Force Logic so that you don't have to worry about dying too fast. Do I not have fire? I got fire too. Probably get regen. Okay, well, that fight was somehow. Less stressful than dealing with a bunch of snakes, believe it or not. I wonder what's up with that other teleporter that's red. I think it has something to do with the other ruins. Oh, makes you wonder. Where's the next town to? Euphoria Pumpkin! Sounds like a Halloween special about high schoolers. Oh, 
Oh, what we got here? Yeah! Maple potato! Yeah, <laughs> yo! That sounds good in real life. Barren plains? Yo! We kind of ran out of money to put music here, so here's some ambience. I can feel the wind blowing here from fridging heights. It carries a faint magical energy. Only those with powerful magical energy can cross the mountain. I wonder what lies across it. Oh. Probably more snow. That's all we've been seeing. I guess if I had like one criticism of I Am Setsuna. Every area just feels the same. Like, yeah, the music is different for each region, but it's all snow. Oh, and there's forest. Then there's snow. Maybe some mountains here and there. Oh, snow. Maybe ice and snow. It's just like winter is back home before I moved into town. Gatherington. Sounds like a great name for a high-end shopping mall. Well, I never. Come here through the blizzard, have ya? Phew. I knew it'd be colder here. But I didn't think it was gonna be this bad. Julianne! Young lady. Are you... There is no cause for alarm. I am merely somewhat fatigued. Are you two from this town? We're on a journey. A journey? We're on Earth too. We're heading for the Last Lands. How far are they from here? The Last Lands, eh? They're on the other side of Fridging Heights. But you'd be best off forgetting that idea if you value your life. That mount can no longer be crossed. What do you mean? You'll have seen him during your journey, no doubt. The distortions in space. We call them black holes around these parts. They're especially bad in the mountains near here, you see. Is there no other route? I did once know of a cave that led through the mountain. It's gone now, is it? No. I said I once knew of it. For some reason, I can no longer remember it. So you forgot where it was? I do not know. I shouldn't think you're gonna believe this. But a memory that should be there... isn't. A memory that should be there isn't? A cave that led through the mountain definitely did exist. That much is certain. But how can you know that for certain if you don't remember? Many folks in this town say the exact same thing as me. Folks who've lived here for a very long time. If you think that nothing more than a coincidence, well, that's up to you. If it's somewhere near here, why don't we try looking for it? You say it definitely existed, so maybe we'll find it. You shall do no such thing. There should be no needless prying. Ah! Phew, don't scare me like that, old lady. Some things are best left unchanged. Not that you are capable of changing them anyway. Wow, who peed in her metamucil? Come on, let's get a move on. If no one knows where this path is, our only option is to try and find a way across ourselves. We don't have time to wait for this blizzard to stop. Or for the distortions to disappear. Our journey must go on. Exactly! Eterna's right. Let's find a way across Fridging Heights by ourselves. Easier said than done, I suppose. Actually, before we go into the pub... 
There might be some items around here. Back when I was a boy, there were never this many monsters. And I often used to go up the mountain. I know I used to get there through a cave, but I can't remember where it was for the life of me. Oh, this leads to a new area. I didn't want to go there yet. Well, actually, let's just go beyond. Oh, I thought there'd be something over there on this little section. Oh, fridging caves! That was easy to find. I wonder if there's a way to just make that disappear. An ancient silver pot. So, I mean, it does lead somewhere. Another maple potato. Abandoned village? Hello. One village continues to oppose the monsters. For the sake of the mainland, and all humanity. Why must the people of the village of sacrifice bear such a burden? No matter what might have happened in the past, the past is just that. The past. Uh, it doesn't look like there's anything here. You can't even open the doors. I wonder how she would survive in this place, if it's just her. Eh, it looks pretty bleak. I don't know if I want to go in yet. Well, I probably got all the stuff that I can find currently, so guess what? We can probably go talk to every NPC now. Actually, we haven't looked what's in Gatherington. Blue peppermint? There's usually like two or three things in one village. It's got an awful lot of uh, Winterhold vibes from Skyrim. You know, just outside the magic school. Only without the occasional dragon. Yeah, maybe there is only one thing here. Let's just drop off our ingredients. Actually, we should drop off the materials I meant to say. Ancient silver pot can go... And that, well, pretty much everything that's not food. Oh man, we got a lot. Oh seriously, we got a lot. Oh, we're in quintuple digits now. Enjoy while it lasts. Oh, right, where we can just get the Sprit Knight now to cost us no money. Duh. Wall? I guess I can get wall. Oh, Blade Wave would be cool, but I don't have a slicing wing feather. Life? Oh, I should get that. Do I have anything that gets rid of ailments? This only nullifies the next two turns. I don't have slow, but you don't really get a lot. And we don't have a lot of materials for it, and I might need it for something else.
Diffuse? Ca cast Diffusing Magical Energy on the selected item, causing it to affect all allies instead of just one. That's kind of weird. Might hold off on that. A precise Thrust. Well, I guess I could get something for Julianne. She doesn't have a lot of moves. Ah, uh, there's Iron Vow. We already got that. Ooh, increasing the SP accumulated when the ATB gauge is full. Oh, we should get that. Get three, actually. Soul Rage? What is Eternal Recurrence? When text of the same elements are used in a row, a counter rise in actions increase in power based on it. Oh. I don't care about that. Eh, this selection is not spectacular. That darn brother of mine spends all day making bets and gambling. Why won't he get a job? Oh, how I hate him! There's a cave not far from here, but it's a dead end. It doesn't lead anywhere at all. If you think I'm lying, I'd be more than happy to put a bet on it. Wow, your, your sister wasn't lying. Alright, what do you got? Ooh, Damascus? Can strengthen a weapon to roughly one half of its maximum stats. Ooh, that's much better to get the Mithril. Is that the highest you can get? Because if so, I wouldn't mind actually putting some money down on it. Okay, I should go for the stuff that's 5,900. Oh, the Phantasma is better than what I already have. Begin battle with a full ATB gauge. As good as that is, I kind of like the Ribbon Chakram. But I should definitely get Avalanche. And we'll get Phantasma. You know, we'll get the Crescent Staff, too. And the Vitality Blade. And we'll get this, too. The Black Cross. And already we're pretty low on money. That didn't take long. And just like that, we're already broke. Coiled Parsley? Huh. I can't believe I missed that earlier. Well, let's just stop here. And then the next part, we'll uh, do a little bit more exploring around the town. And go check out that cave. See everyone, thanks for watching.